Hey guys, I'm Kate with Type Match, and I was just thinking about where we derive significance and meaning in our lives and how that relates to MBTI and the cognitive functions, because I'm always trying to um, draw connections between type and other topics. And I came up with something that I think um, may be true. So if we define significance as the impact that we are having on others and meaning as the impact that something has on you individually, as in like um, what is meaningful for you, what matters, what's important, then we can draw connections between significance and the cognitive function, extroverted feeling, FE, and meaning and um, FI, introverted feeling. So the other day I saw someone talking about um, Viktor Frankl's Man's Search for Meaning and how in his book he argues that people are driven to search for meaning. And there's three ways that we can find that. One is through our work and achievements and doing something significant, which I would argue like, okay, those are all significance rather than meaning. Um, two is through relationships, through love, for caring for someone. Once again, like um, that sounds more like significance because it's an impact on others. But three, you know, if those two are taken away for you, from you, like they were for him in the concentration camps, then he said that you could find meaning from finding courage in the face of suffering, which to me just um, sounds like being in survival mode. And of course we are driven to survive, but maybe this is just a fundamental misunderstanding of meaning for me because I, I struggle with it, with having, like if I'm drawing a parallel there um, between meaning and introverted feeling, I struggle with that in my life and finding like what is meaningful to me is I have um, FI polar, but I do really care about significance and like how what I'm doing has an impact on others. And I think about people like Tom Bilyeu. He, um, he has a podcast called Impact Theory because, you know, after making his health foods company, he's like, well, what can I do now? How can I impact more people? And this is like, is right there in the name. He's got FE. That's what he wants to do. He wants to have the broadest impact on the most people. Whereas I think FI is more about um, in what you individually stand for and finding personal meaning in your work, even um, though the two can be highly linked with doing what is impactful can have a lot of meaning for you and, you know, and vice versa. But I think the, the definitions are separate, even though they can be highly linked. So if this is the case, then we can say that, um, we can see that ENTJ and ESTJ, because they have FI inferior, can spend the early part of their lives like chasing achievements and working, working, working towards things that at the end, they question like, was this actually FI meaningful to me? Like I totally forgot to even look here, but now as I'm getting later in life, I want to say like, okay, well, now I want to do work that is um, meaningful for my inferior function. Whereas INTP and ISTP with FE inferior can work on creating something or a logical system, but not sharing it with anyone or creating something that's really only useful to themselves and forgetting about the FE broader impact that it could it could have on others if they were able to create something that is useful um, and significant for a broader audience. But they're not the only ones that can have issues with this, you know, like, okay, like I alluded to myself earlier because I have a polar function of FI. It's really hard for me to attach anything having meaning for me 
personally, like, and all I care about is the significance. And, you know, for INTJ and ISTJ, it would be the reverse, um, thinking only about the meaning for them rather than the, the significance for others of their, their work and actions, their relationships. Um, and then with FI Hero for INFP and ISFP, they can, because they have it like top, they can become very altruistic and sacrificing themselves for their ideals or for, the, for their cause. And FE DOMs, ESFJ and ENFJ can become also self-sacrificing, but for the sake of others. And while that sounds great and that sounds very romantic for both of them, you know, it's beautiful, but you can't help others unless you can help yourself. And, you know, I would advise them that you have to clean up your own house before you try to clean up the whole world. So this balance between um, meaning and significance and finding what is meaningful, finding what's significance, and then balancing that with your own personal needs is something that the types all need to like go through their own different um, journeys when, when confronting these questions. So let me know what you guys think about that. Please like and subscribe to this channel to support Type Match and check out the Type Match app. Your personality is unique. It's hard to find someone that understands you. Try dating using personality type matching. Find out who you're compatible with using Myers-Briggs and Big Five personality scores. Download Type Match and start dating by personality type compatibility today. Type Match, available on App Store and Play Store.